Um, I think gaming will certainly be right. an issue that rises to the top. Um, Where do you stand on yeah. that? You know, I, I'm, I'm somebody who just, I think the body can have an opportunity to have a conversation about it. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't say I'm agnostic to it, but it's not something that you know, I really have a strong stance for or against. Okay. Uh, I think, you know, we have to recognize that Florida is the fourth largest gaming state, so if we're going to be that state... You know, we need to have a structure. For me, I'm, I'm most focused on a potential regulatory structure. Right mm-hmm. now, you know, gaming is managed through DBPR, which, you know, I think it works for just the paramutuals, but from a broader sense, you know, if we had a regulatory component that was put in place, I think that would be uh, something that I would be most focused on. Um, and then also the idea, if we did do something with gaming, making sure that the future would, would include something to do with okay. Uh, a referendum, and you know anything that went beyond that would be done through a referendum. Um, I think that Medicaid expansion is certainly going to—it's already become part right. of the conversation. Um, you know, obviously, we feel that uh, there was a referendum on the ballot in this last election, and, and anything and everything that was attached to Obamacare was certainly, um, you know, put down. And, and now that conversation is coming back up again. So, you know, we feel comfortable in the House where we stand on that issue. Obviously. Uh, there are different groups that are going to continue to try to find other opportunities, you know, to work within those boundaries.